as Super Badge got here. He was here for about not even five minutes. And guess what? We got power again. So I had off camera went through and checked every outlet in the apartment, every GFCI, and reset. When I pushed the reset button on them, none of them were tripped and still got nothing. Well, he gets here and he's like, did you check the GFCI outside? It's like, no, I didn't even know there was one outside. And yeah, he, uh, he opened this door here, I'll show you. Right there. That, that was our, uh, that was our culprit right there. That was, well, it was tripped and uh, it was not getting power because it's ran to there before here, I guess, from the breaker box or however that works. So, time to button this all back up and get the heck out of here. So, I was thinking I was going to have to upload this as a fail and have to just upload what I had. Because I didn't even think that Keith was going to be able to figure I didn't know if we were going to get it figured out today. I really didn't. But that's just because I've never known, I never knew there was a GFCI right outside the door. I've worked here for almost a year and never knew there was a GFCI right outside of the door. I guess it's not like that on every apartment though, so it's just in this building. Because we have uh, the U-shaped buildings. Yeah, so we have three different style buildings, plus our triplex, which is like a duplex, it's only a tri, it's three of them, so hence the name triplex. And then we have like ten houses. 285 units, all together. So yeah. Um, I guess I miss things like that. But hey, I learned something new today, so I can't really complain. And I got a pretty dang long video now for somebody to watch if they want to sit down and watch the whole thing. And uh, maybe get a few laughs at my expense because I kind of felt like a dunce there for a minute. But... It's all good, nothing to worry about. No harm, no foul. There we go. It's a learning curve every day. I learn something new every day almost. Dang it, and I cannot keep a hold of this one single screw. I've dropped it. Three times now? I don't know. Two, three. But yeah, so sorry about the length of this video because I, it's in segments. Well, I've got it in segments. You're going to get to it all at once. But uh, I know it's quite lengthy, so I apologize. And uh, I'll try to take something out if there's nothing really super important. But I think it's all pretty. I mean, it's, it's my. In my standards, decent quality. It's not gonna get that great yet. I gotta still get a better camera and still start doing my video editing from my computer because I'm literally doing everything off of my phone. I have a video editing app. I'm sure you've seen the little in shot at the bottom there. They're not a sponsor or anything because obviously <laughs> I just started this thing, so there's no way I have a sponsor or anything. I just use their app. So, thanks to InShot for letting me use their app. Shout out to them. And uh, hopefully they don't try to sue me or anything for using it to edit my videos for YouTube. So I'll have to figure something out. But, I mean, I don't plan on using it for very much longer. Just till I can uh, I get my tax check back here soon. Hopefully, and then I plan on getting a camera. And then I will uh, start doing it all via the camera and uploading it onto my computer. And... Um, Editing them there. Sorry, kind of forgot what I was saying there for a second. But yeah, so we got outlet back together. We will.
slap this back together now. This big old mess. Alright, now I'm trying to stay out of the way as much as possible. Set if I get it, all this back together though, and then come to find out the ballast was out too, and I gotta take it all back apart. Well, it's not really a lot back apart, it's just different things. I haven't even taken gotten into the ballast yet. I just have to cut a bunch of wires, reattach, go down, get a new ballast, come back up, and re oh, boom, reattach them. So we're good to go. And Tell me it's a ballast that's out now, too. Maybe I didn't. Uh, I don't know. Oh, man. And it continues because I cannot catch a break today. Something as simple as chain this. Getting the light going. Well, this just goes to show you. You never know what you're going to come across. Now what the heck? It's just barely touching, that's why. Just barely on there. Or at least, I'm hoping that's why. Those wires were just barely touching. most likely our issue there that wire was not that strong it broke pretty dang easily just trying to put the back together and I don't know what I did with my dang wire clippers watching. If anybody's even watching at this point, I probably honestly would have stopped watching this video myself a long time ago. Maybe. I don't know. Ugh. Come on, Jake. Get it together. Get it together, Jake. All right, round, whatever, I don't need to know. Two, three, four. How many times did I think I was gonna figure out the issue in this video and then actually didn't? 
I don't even remember. this video problems 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 and I might be the problem solver but I doubt it because it's taken me this long and I haven't solved anything yet nothing what the heck is it tripping this outfit out here issue there was a combination of things. I think it was that wire that I was talking about being our issue. It broke off right as soon as I tried to tighten that wire nut again. So I think that was maybe causing an arc or something and it tripped that GFCI again. And also I think my issue was I was putting in one light bulb at a time and I was kind of turning it off and on. But uh, anyways, problem solved. Kitchen light working. Switch off, on, off, on. Finally, so sorry about the length on this video. Never mind, are you serious? I guarantee it's this GFCI. Yep, all right. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video, guys because that's getting on my nerves and I don't want it to be a super, super long video. It already is a really long video, I know, longer than any of my other ones. So I apologize for that again, and I'm going to take care of this GFCI off camera. Later, guys. All right, quick update. GFCI fixed, light taken care of, no further issues. But all right, guys, like I said, sorry about the length. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.